Hey, what up guys? I just wanted to do a quick video while I'm in my car here. Um, a friend of mine recently passed away to suicide and um, I've gone through some really rough stuff and I think everybody, everybody is on this ascension process. When we're trying to purge all this energy and all this energy of our ancestors as well, being these divine light beings, you know, we we incarnate here on earth to serve humanity and part of that is going through all this rough stuff to to bring those lower energies up and raise those frequencies you know and i think the most important thing is self-love and knowing how to do that is it's hard it's it's really really hard to love yourself sometimes like i went through some some tough things and what got me into the the lowest pit of it all was hating myself, you know, and it was hard to go from, like, self -lo self-loathing into pure, divine, and, like, unconditional love for yourself, you know, and, um, the way I started doing that was just by meditating on my heart and loving my heart and loving the feelings, like, I used to get these really bad feelings in my, all over my body, um, when I would have a bad thought, it would, it would not necessarily be the bad thought, um, but it would be hating myself for that, having that thought that came in. And then I would feel like a stabbing pain in, in my shoulder or my back or the pressure on my chest like I've talked about. And um, just going back to that self-love and um, what kind of like in the beginning when I was going through this process of learning how to like love myself, I always doubted it and um, like doubted my ability to get past some of these things that I've gone through, some of these em lower emotions and, and doubt is one of the hardest ones because if you doubt your ability to love then it kind of cuts it, cuts it in half, you know. But the thing is, is that love is vastly stronger, the power of of love is way way stronger so if you keep reminding yourself and going back to love over and over and over again and like holding love and I've talked about like holding it like I used to struggle with anxiety and holding love energy here on both sides of my head while in my heart and like focusing the attention on that feeling there and loving it you know um, that helped a lot um, but again it's all about beating that doubt and doubting yourself that you can you can fix your 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 brain you know like you can put the pieces back together or rise above it you know and if you keep loving every single time that thought of doubt creeps in you know and i it still happens with me but i've i've gotten to a point where all the pressure in my chest is gone and like I'm starting to live in the moment again after so long of, of like living in my head and I, I've talked about like I can get into the into that state of bliss consciousness while meditating and stuff but it's hard to do during my normal day like everyday activity and um, yeah it's just loving loving and loving and loving and every time the doubt creeps back in you just love yourself hold that emotion in your heart and um, yeah, um, I'm trying to think, I think there's one more thing I wanted to say, um, hmm, that'll come to me later probably, make another video, but thanks guys, peace. <laughs>